because I've been receiving a lot many questions. So guys, first of all, uh, the thing is that uh, like some people, some students haven't received the amount which we which you paid to ACCA uh, before 27th of July. The reason for that is maybe you had something in your debit balance like something related to your exemption fee or something related to your annual subscription like that. So you had something in your debit balance due to which you have received less than what you were supposed to receive. For example, this is the account of one of my students and uh, she uh, had the uh, you know 40 pounds in the debit balance before she booked her exam for FR financial reporting and now what she have received uh, in her account ACC account is just pound 71 though she paid triple uh, one pounds for the FR exam right so the reason for that is that because 40 pounds were uh, there in her uh, you know the debit balance in the ACC account due to the exemption fee so if I just view the transactions I can just see it that in the last this one the last transaction that is uh, 5th October 2019 she has been having the exemption fee pending because I was the one who booked the exam before the standard uh, entry also for her so I know that there was a balance of 40 pounds standing here uh, in the account and now when she made a payment of triple one and she's just received 71 because that's how the mechanism of ACCA works so now when she will book the exam she'll have to pay another 40 pounds before she makes a payment for the FR exam so let's just try and make a payment for the FR exam let's go and see how we make a payment see she uh, will we will go first to book your exam I won't make the payment like uh, she has to read some uh, terms and conditions and she's to perform her system test before I do make a payment for her so see that is triple one here one in her credit balance and the total payment she's required to make which I can see from this blurred block of pay now that you have to pay 40 pounds right so guys just take a chill uh, I've been getting a lot of messages that we paid this much and now we've just received this so that is due to your debit balance which was already there and now you've received less of it so that's fine you have to make a payment now and uh, let me just show you that how we will proceed I will first I just uh, what I did was I added an exam and I went on at home so this is the option where I'm supposed to go I have to go to at home and then select the exam and that way I got this FR exam here and then uh, I'll go to confirm availability I will read all the instructions where there is written that there should there should be no one in your room there should be no disturbance uh, there should be a photographic uh, you know identity proof and uh, how ACCA takes your uh, agreement it takes your uh, you know uh, yes on the fact that they you allow them to take their pictures during the exam like they will see that whether the person who's giving the exam is the same person as the uh, photo identity proof says so yes you have to click on that when you just you know you have to click on this thing I agree to use the facial recognition software for the purpose of verifying my identity so I'm not doing it for her she'll do it herself she'll read the things and she'll uh, uh, say yes to the terms and condition herself and then they don't allow you to book an exam uh, if you haven't yet performed the system test so yes about the system guys uh, there are some uh, email received uh, where you've been seeing that geofi and the uh, other you know modems are not allowed the thing which i emailed to the acca body and one by the acca that is according to the minimum specific requirements so that is all about the requirements and everything so there's no big issue and don't get you know just uh, some I, I i know some students who when this news came up when the geofi is not allowed or when the modems are not allowed they just didn't uh, hesitated uh, they has hesitated while booking their exam they was like we will give in december because we can't change our connection at this point in time that's not feasible for them due to the pandemic going on in their state so guys uh, just have a chill about it it's allowed it's just that the system even says a yes even if you're using a hotspot that how will they come to know that uh, you're using a geofi or whether you're using a wired or unwired connection so that is given that it is recommended it's recommended that you should use this they have not said that 
it is not allowed they specifically mentioned this clause that uh, you know you you should not use the hotspot the mobile hotspot so that's the only thing which is prohibited and if you have anything else other than that which gives you the minimum speed required then it's fine you're good to go okay and that's that's i can clarify on it and uh, that's it about that's about it so you can perform the system test which again now guys uh i can't go to that section because she have not performed the test yet and uh, there is she have not read these uh, before i book the exam for her so when i'll book the exam i will see something uh, like there will be fr for the uh, financial reporting there will be number of uh, options available like f2 f1 f3 don't get confused they are not specifically the financial accounting exam the f1 the f2 and the f3 exams no they're not those exams it's just that it's a time slot each time slot and decide according to your convenience which you want to give right so they are all the time slots and